right now. Three men, demonstrators on Eastern Washington University's Cheney campus, led to a massive student-led counter-protest that ultimately involved dozens of people and at least one person was arrested. Good evening, I'm Stephanie Vigil. This all started just afternoon today when those men showed up with a microphone and portable speaker shouting out their interpretation of the Bible. Students quickly took notice. By 2 o'clock, students had the demonstrators surrounded. KHQ's Corey Howard was the first reporter on scene. He showed up to a very chaotic scene, Corey. Yeah, Steph, a very chaotic scene, a very passionate scene, much quieter on the Eastern Washington University campus now. But earlier today, those three men uh, using their First Amendment rights to spread a message, a message that students here simply called hate speech. And on the other side, you had that passionate student body who resoundingly responded with, they didn't want it at their school. Hundreds of students coming together at the center of Eastern Washington University, united by three men who, according to students I talked with, began walking through campus this morning with messages of hate towards the LGBTQ community, women and minorities. Students were upset, encountered with strength in numbers and a message of their own, get out. The crowd grew and law enforcement began to separate the two sides and call in other agencies to keep the peace or as much peace as could be kept. One of the three men was arrested and charged with assault after police say he spat on a woman and grabbed her butt. But the other two men remained and both sides weren't budging until a student body president got up in front of the crowd and asked the students not to give the men the platform and the reaction that they wanted by simply ignoring them and leaving. Though some remained, most students left with their point made. They kept yelling about how, like, God is the only way you can get love, but, like, with the amount of people out here, everybody showing support, like, we've got so much love coming from the community. It's been, it's been fantastic. We need to put a stop to all this hate, and it doesn't matter who's spreading that hate, is that we needed to take a stop to it. We're not going to back down because they want to exactly. keep coming, and all these officers just standing around, I don't think it's right either. We're not exactly. going to is... let them spread hate on a place where we're supposed to feel safe. Like, we should show love to one another no matter what. No matter what race, no matter what religion, it doesn't matter. This campus is a safe space, and we're working hard to keep it safe. Now, I asked police what would happen if these men came back. They said Eastern Washington University is a a state school. It's a public campus. They have their right to free speech. They're simply here to keep the peace. Uh, They did say, Lieutenant McLaughlin with the EW police did say, they echo the student body president's message. If they come back, just ignore them. Don't give them the attention they want, and they'll leave. In Cheney tonight, Corey Howard, KHQ Local News.